Accurate Weather with Kelly Simek. Hello, uh, everybody. We had such a light show that was incredible last night and in the overnight hours, but things have definitely lightened up. Taking a look at our live Zephyr Cam, which we have been seeing very active in the overnight hours. Well, it's definitely, again, cleared out, and we've been seeing, for the most part, just darker skies. The heavier showers, the thunderstorms have diminished at least over land within the last couple of hours, but they definitely do persist across some local waters, and that's mainly true just to the south of Oahu. You can see still convection here on the satellite. Now, take Taking a look at the satellite, some areas are going to be waking up to a bit of sunshine for today. Don't let that sunshine fool you. Very similar to yesterday, we woke up to perfectly clear skies here on Oahu. For the most part, land breezes it looks like should be keeping the skies fairly clear for us, at least in terms of the heavier showers. But with daytime heating coming through, we are expecting those afternoon showers to really ramp up once that daytime heating sets in. We have a cold front coming in from the northwest. That's Easing the pressure gradient. Unfortunately, our trade winds not as strong as what they were yesterday, so it is looking like a variable wind pattern taking over with sea breezes dominating in the afternoon. Uh, in terms of the heavy rainfall, again, because although it's lightened up on each island for the most part in the last couple of hours, we do still have moderate to heavy showers near the state. So for today, there is still the threat that we could see some of those across each island. And again, the higher precipitation potential and the higher chance for those thunderstorms definitely going to be in the afternoon hours. Now, don't get me wrong, even though the rain Rainfalls lightened up. We're still seeing some of that taking a look uh, over towards the windward side here on Oahu and over the Ko'olau. Still seeing some showers, but they're much lighter than what we were seeing earlier. Not really seeing the flooding conditions right now, but it is a possibility. So that flash flood watch was extended for each island through the afternoon hours. And we have some scattered showers coming through for Maui County and Hawaii Island. Future satellite and radar does still show the widespread showers through today. Let's look at three o'clock, and you can see all the way from Kauai to Hawaii Island. We're still seeing the rain, but in the overnight hours, big improvements, and then that continues with us, with us through Wednesday. And simultaneously, not only are we going to be seeing the skies start to clear out, but we're also going to be seeing trade winds pick up, and quite significantly, it's going to be really breezy to end off this work week with winds to 30 miles an hour. So blustery conditions out there today. Variable winds blowing around 15 miles an hour. Tomorrow they pick up speed, and then they're very gusty starting with us on Thursday. Back to sunshine just in time for the weekend. All right, that's like your weather. Now let's welcome in Chris Latronic, who has your traffic. Good morning, Chris.